What's up? Hearthstone just announced their next expansion, the Boomsday Project, which we're, it will release August 7th of this year. And I just wanted to go over the cards that they have shown so far and give my opinion of them from uh, worst to best. And the first one we start with is Myra's Unstable Element, Legendary Rogue Spell. Five mana, draw the rest of your deck. I think this card is pretty bad. Mostly because if it does what it says it does and it actually draws the rest of your deck, instantly put you into uh, fatigue and you can only hold so many cards anyways so you won't actually be getting the benefit of all those cards that you just drew so that's terrible the only other card that I can think of that does something similar to this is roll the bones draw a card if it's a death rattle cast this again now if you have your whole deck full of death rattles I've seen this before it will stop drawing you cards if your hand is full so this saves you from going into fatigue and wasting all the cards in your deck whereas this card I don't, I don't really see the point in unless, like by the time that this card could be useful it will be the end of the game and maybe you have no cards in hand and you you want to draw the full cards for five mana then you only have five more mana that turn then you start taking fatigue damage so yeah it could be good at that point but for the rest of the game this is a dead card in your hand I don't see the point in this card which really disappoints me because rogue is my favorite class next card spider bomb magnetic what this what this does is when you play a mech this will look for another mech that you play with and then it will combine the two so if you have a mecha on the board already and then you cast this the two cards will fuse together they will combine stats attack and health and they will combine abilities now I don't really see the see this card being great right now but they haven't shown all the rest of the mechs and either even if they do show the rest of the mechs I can't really see this card being that great because it basically puts all your eggs in one basket so you kill one of your own minions to fuse the end of this minion and then they kill this minion and then yes this minion will destroy one of their minions but they've used one one thing to kill this garbage minion and you've already killed one of your minions so you just two for one yourself basically so I'm not sure I like this card now we have Electra Storm Surge Legendary Elemental, Battlecry, your next spell. This turn cast twice. This could be very useful on some control decks. With uh, Healing Rain, if you cast this before that, that could save your ass really easy. And, uh, could also go with, like, Lightning Storm. This could be good, but it, it's definitely slow because you're definitely not going to want to cast this by itself, but I guess you can if you have to. I'm sure people will find a spot for this card. Next card. Now this card I actually think is very good. 4 mana. 2-6 Tauner. Battlecry. If you have 10 mana crystals gain plus 10 attack. Now I think this card is really good because it has quite a bit of health in the early game to defend you with. And late game if you have 10 mana crystals a 4 mana taunt will usually be worthless, but this 10 mana, it'll have 10 attack and 6 power. That is ridiculous. I can see this easily fitting into taunt warriors or taunt druids. This is a very good card, I think. And the last card, biology project, 1 mana. Each player gains 2 mana crystals. Now, I'm not sure if this card will see a lot of play, but it's definitely really powerful if uh, think of it this way you built your deck knowing that you're using this card and the people that you play against they built their deck so they can play normally so they have a bunch of low-costing minions or spells in their deck 
not not counting on getting so many mana crystals so fast whereas you did so you can take full advantage of this and they might not be able to so I think that is a very powerful card I do expect that this card will see at least a lot of play in the beginning of the format so that's uh, my review of the new cards that were released